Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Um, today's video is a bit of a different video. It's more of the detailing side of things. So I've gone and picked up um, an Auto Bright Direct mystery box, which is about I think it's about forty quid. Um, I will just say they are out of stock now, and they're not going to be stocking any more of these. So unfortunately, I can't link it in the description because I got one very last. However, what I'm going to do is show you sort of what we got in there. Now, what I brought, I did say there was about £80 worth of value. So, every product that I talk about and show you, I will put the official price on their website at this current time on the screen. Just so that at the end, we can then finally add up how much and what value we actually got out of this mystery box. And was it worth it? So, yeah, let's go through the product. So, as soon as you open the box there, just got a bit saying, are you ready? And just some of their Instagram, Facebook, Twitter and all that stuff. So when you open the box, this is what you get. So for a start, we can see we've got six bottles and some spray triggers. So first one that's already got a trigger on is, let's have a look. So we've got Cleanse, which is, let's see if it'll focus. It's a gentle leather cleaner. So... If we just have a look at the back on here, so it's a pH neutral level cleaner, uh, powerful enough to tackle the most stubborn ingrained dirt, yet gentle enough to be safe on all leather surfaces, including vintage leather, ripping dirt without stripping the leather of its natural oils. So, so you can spray it onto a cloth or a towel. I mean, I, what I quite like using at the moment is the um, microfiber scrub pads. So if you've got like leather seats. Spray this on your scrub pad and then work it into the seat and wipe away with a microfiber towel. I mean, from experience, I'd probably, I'm probably going to say this product is going to be 10 or 12 pounds, something like that. So we'll just set that to the side down there. So, next one looks like it's uh, shaken up a bit. So, we've got Cherry Glaze, which is a polish glaze and a wax. Looks quite nice there. I mean, I don't tend to use this sort of stuff, however. We may try it in a video or something like that. So it's an all-in-one paintwork polish and protectant that leaves your car gleaming. It cleans, removes stubborn oxidization, reduces light scratches, masks light imperfections, and protects. Very nice. It's got a light bl uh, blend of abrasives to rejuvenate and restore your paintwork. Very nice. So I would probably say this is probably going to be around eight or ten pound mark again um just by the nature of the product obviously these are 500 mil as well now one thing i want to say is it is good that they do give you the triggers in these as well um because that's one thing you don't want to be having to purchase extra so oh looks like we've got a special edition here so we've got bubblegum quick detailer which is part of their finish range so so it is da -da -da. Let's have a look. So it's a quick detailing spray that can be used on the inside and outside of your vehicle. Application is a simple spray and wipe. For use on interior plastics, spray onto a microfiber towel and wipe over the surface to leave a clean looking matte finish with a delicious scent. For exterior surfaces, apply a light mist and buff until residue appears. Now, I'm, I am currently running out of my garage therapy quick detailer, so to be fair, this will be a good one to try. So yeah, fantastic. All I want to say is, as I was editing this video, I tried searching up the Bubblegum Quick Detailer to see what the retail price was, but they don't seem to sell it. So I would estimate a product of this would be around the £12 mark. However, obviously I can't confirm because they don't currently sell it. So we'll look at this one. The next product, ah, Project 64, my favourite thing this is. So this is um, sort of an exterior gloss enhancer and protection at the same time. And I sort of call this stuff liquid gold because the gloss that this adds to your vehicle is just nuts. Um, and I actually went to Jackfest about, I think it was in April, Jackfest was, and I managed to pick a bottle of this up for three quid because they were getting rid of a load, uh, a load of stock. So, but I know this retails for about 12 or 13 quid. 
Um, so we'll just read what it says on the back because obviously my explanation is different to what what they say. So um, essentially, it's an incredibly easy apply with spray white buff application. Um, great hydrophobic qualities, ensuring treated surface stays protected for longer. It's safe to use on all surfaces of your vehicle's exterior, paint, glass, bright work, alloy wheels, and is also safe over ceramic coatings. So even if you have a ceramic coating and you would want to add a bit of top up protection every time you're washing a bit of gloss, this seems like the product to go for. But I use this stuff and honestly you do not need a lot, maybe one to two sprays of panel and that is it. So looks like we've got a shampoo here. Looks like uh, a famous Costa, I must say, yeah. Water Bright Direct Hazelnut Latte Shampoo, Cars and Coffee Edition. So it looks like another special edition that they're getting rid of. So let's see what the dilutions are on this. So um, a dilution ratio of 1500 to 1 um, equals 10 ml or a single cap per 18 litre bucket, which is very good, um, I must say. So always wash from the top down, applying minimal pressure. We all know that stuff. I don't need to explain that stuff. But yeah, I mean, I'm probably going to guess this is probably around sort of the 10, 11 pound mark again. Same as a lot of the products. And then, so we've got three triggers in there, plus obviously the other two there. The final product is, ooh, Ceramic Shield Auto Bright Refresh Ceramic Topper Slash Sealant. Like their finish range so have a look at this i have heard about this in the auto bright forum um i think this is quite expensive i think this is about 25 20 25 quid for just this 500 ml bottle and i know some people did have problems applying this but i think when people were applying it they were over applying it so putting too much per panel um so ceramic shield topper Oh, sorry, it, it, the refresh can be used as a ceramic topper for protecting, boosting ceramic coatings or as a standalone ceramic infused spray sealant. Developed using the latest technology, this product contains hydrophobic polymers that bond to the surface to provide a chemically and mechanically resistant top coat. So, um, if they say it's most effective when used on a decontaminated surface, initial full decontamination is required for standalone use. If using on top of an existing ceramic protection, a chemical decontamination would be minimum requirement. Application is a two towel process. Apply a light mist to a medium pile microfiber applied to the surface of the vehicle and work over a small area. Leave the product for 30 seconds, then using a second plush microfiber. Buff. Okay, yeah, I reckon this is probably going to be quite expensive. Um, I might try this out to be fair, maybe maybe I might do a video on it if you guys want to see that. Um, if you guys want to see videos on any of these particular products in the video, um, sort of please let me know in the comments so I can sort of, when I've got some time off, make some videos on these. Um, shampoos, they are all much for muchness to be honest, um, but obviously having a nice scent is going to be pretty good. Um, I would guess out of all of this sort of range here i'll just show you all here so i'd say about 12 quid for that maybe a tenner for the quick detailer tenner for the glaze so sort of around 32 quid maybe a tenner for the cleanse i'd say 42 shampoo 52 and with that i'm probably going to guess this is probably around 77 78 pounds worth of stuff so yeah if you guys think i've got good value in this mystery box please let me know in the comments um I personally think that this is a pretty good mystery box. The only thing I might not use because I don't tend to use sort of waxes on more like ceramic stuff like a refresh, for example, um, is the cherry glaze. So if anyone is any car meets in the future, um, I am at JDM Comb in July. If you do want this, let me know. Um, and you can just come come to my car, obviously, when it's on the stand. Um, and you can have it off me for nothing. So, yeah, I um, hope you guys enjoyed this little video. Um, any sort of future videos that you'd like to see, just drop them down in the comments. Um, sort of reason I've got a bit of a mess over here as I am in the process of sort of doing my calipers at the moment and painting them. So stay tuned for that video. Um, I think it, 
I've done the front ones, but I'm going to film the back ones because I just wanted to see how it would look and what the outcome would be first. So, yeah, stay tuned. Make sure to hit the notification bell, drop a subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Have a nice day. Bye.